the fine Chinaman, answering your questions. Together we can preserve great dining traditions. Fine Chinaman here, and today I want to answer a question from one of my viewers about how I um, organize and set up uh, China cabinets for uh, display purposes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you into my butler's pantry and I'm going to show you three different patterns and three different cupboards. Now granted these are cupboards, not china cabinets, but it's the same idea you just would get on a larger scale if you're doing a full china cabinet. The reason I'm taking you in there though is I want to show you different types of patterns and different reasons for displaying them. So uh, two of the cabinets, the first one and the third one I'm going to show you, are really there for uh, maximum display. The second one I'm going to show you is more for usability, and so I'm a little less concerned about display, but it still looks very nice. So let me show you what I, uh, how I set things up in my butler's pantry. All right, so for my first set, my butler's pantry, I'm going to show you is Old Britain Castles in Blue by Johnson Brothers. The neat thing about this set is that every type of piece has a different scene on it. So the goal is, is to put the most scenes visible when you look at the cabinet. Now this is a small cabinet, but I was able to fit the entire set in here. So let's look at what I did. So I put a dinner, couple dinner plates on display with a platter in the middle on the bottom shelf. The next shelf up, on the very edge over here, I have one bread and butter plate. But then I have a more rare piece in the back, which is the dessert pie plates. So I have four of them. And then I have an old piece, uh, much older than my set, the rest of the set, which is a square salad plate. I have cups and saucers with their design, and I have the tea service. So uh, lots of different uh, castles on this shelf. Up on this shelf, which is a little harder to see, um, I have the modern salad plates along with a really nice bowl. Inside this, uh, it, sometimes it looks a little dull if you just have china, so I put these uh, really nice um, blue uh, glass um, goblets in, in the uh, cabinet. Uh, they have um, gold on the outside. And then I added some knife rests for detail. Unlike the previous set, this cabinet contains um, Lady Carlisle, and these Lady Carlisle pieces are what I use on a regular basis so I don't have to disturb my hutch in my dining room. This cabinet is set up purely for convenience. It still looks nice, but as you see, I can get to anything very quickly in this cabinet. So it's a totally different way of, um, of displaying, where I'm not stacking very much. I have stuff very easily accessible. Finally, Miss America in pink. In this case here, it would be a little washed out if I had it by itself. So I added in this really neat uh, nut serving set with individual bowls and a serving bowl. And a few uh, cups and saucers just to add some look and flair to the cabinet. If you like this video, please click the like button below. Please share and subscribe for more videos in the future. See you next time.